Welcome back to the channel everybody. Today we are going to be ice camping obviously as you guys can tell we're already inside the shack. You guys have seen the shack on the channel before like twice I believe. It's actually uh, this guy's shack. Mr. Connor! Oh, what up, what up? What up, Gohee? Nothing much, man. Thanks for letting the voice come out. No problem. Hopefully we can catch some fish, huh? Hoping to. Hoping to. What are we doing this Sunday, though? Super Bowl. <laughs> we gotta catch some fish for the fish fry. Oh, yeah. I'm happy to see you out here. We yeah, got out here a little yeah. late. It's, what, 8 o'clock? Yeah. Had to set up a little late. Shep had work. I had, to, had a little drive ahead of me, but... We're here now. It is dark outside, that's why we're filming inside the shack right now. And it is brutally windy out there as well. But it's supposed to be a nice weekend, and like I was saying, the Super Bowl is this Sunday, so we gotta catch some fish for our annual fish fry that we have during the Super Bowl. So hopefully the boys can uh, clean up shop here and catch us some fish. Kyle's setting up the rattle reels, aren't you, buddy? It's the only hope we got. What, what are we working with here? Just a minnow on there? Uh, yeah, I think there's actually a chub on there. You think we'll get any? Is there a, come All on. right, we also got Shep out here. How you doing, buddy? I'm doing great. Good. How are you doing? Good. Are you excited to catch some fish, hopefully? Hopefully we get some fish in done. I mean... We'll catch some. We'll catch a couple I mean. and... You're no, sure no, like tea, you a tea, we ain't putting those in. I'm not, I'm not going to be the Keystone drinker on cam here. Well, obviously, uh, with all the boys here, we are going to have a good time out on the ice. Um, especially since we got out here so late and we kind of already missed prime time. There's not really much to do besides set rattle reels and kick back and relax with the boys and just kind of chill. Hey Peyton. How's it going? How you doing? Uh, trying to get the cold grill started. Well, good thing I know a restaurant not too far away. Peyton's trying to start the grill to make us some food because none of us have really ate dinner yet. And we're all hungry and we brought food to eat out on the ice. But it doesn't really look like it's going too well for him. He's been out there for a while, but we'll give you guys a little tour of Connor's Permi if you guys have never seen it before. Well, Mr. Connor, how big is she? 24 feet, if you include the V. Nice. And then I think it's 10, 10 feet wide. Right on, yep. bucko. This uh, Ice Castle? Yeah, Ice Castle Trophy Hunter. Yep. Atta boy. You come in from the door here, you got some lovely coat hangers, some stuff you can put up there. Obviously, you got your vents and whatnot. You got your stove top and your little oven and of course the microwave for the White Castle burgers. And then you got four holes in the back here and then up here in the V you actually get two and there's actually a bunk bed here as well. I'm probably gonna be sleeping up top there. Peyton's probably gonna be sleeping here but he's also got a little bathroom which does not get used very much. It's more just for storage. It doesn't shut. Oh, it doesn't no, it, it shut. I don't know why it's not but we also got a rattle reel over here and another one. You got a rattle reel for every hole. I like it. But over here, you got the TV. You got a little window behind the TV as well. And this actually lifts up and there's storage in here. Obviously, you got the master bed where Connor and Tanner cuddle. We get some cuddling done. Yeah, you're pretty touchy, aren't you, Chef? <laughs> Connor, how, how do you feel about that? We just, we just got to be civilized today, Chef. Life's going to go on. We'll be fine. And then you got a top bunk up here as well. But that is pretty much it for Connor's Permi. Um, it's lovely. It is absolutely wonderful being in here. And I'm excited to catch some fish. We didn't want to bring the BBC out. Well, if we had a couple other guys, we definitely would have needed it. But with just five guys, uh, we should be able to get in here just fine. And we're fishing 18 feet of water. We're just out in a big deep flat and uh, hoping the fish come in here. We had a friend come out here not too long ago and did pretty well. So we're hoping for the same results. If not, there's a bunch of different little lakes and sloughs we could go hop to. And I'm sure we could scratch some fish out. But as of right now, this is our best walleye option. So that's why we came here. Hopefully some walleyes overnight. Bauer, you're already eating. You should probably check on the grill guy out there. Maybe he'd figure it out. Well, we got some Uncrustables and some White Castles. Those should probably be sitting outside, hey? Connor? Some WCs? Connor, <laughs> you want a WC, buddy? <laughs> you know, go easy. We gotta break one out. Break. Connor's got a fish. Is it nice? Hey, get in here. Is it nice? I don't think it's not. 
horrible. Oh, Shep, get in here. Oh, get in there. It's a nice it's a one. Nice one. Oh, it's a nice oh, one. No, no, Shep, Shep, Shep. Shep. No. Yeah. Yes. 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 How? That hey, that's so a nice one, like Connor. It's hey, a good 16, 17 <laughs> yeah. inch here, huh? Let's go. Not even five minutes Let's into go. this. Got the hand dirty and they're, they're, in they're almost lost. The chub. The chub worked. But our white cats was probably almost done to celebrate the awesome catch. We're going to be eating good for the Super Bowl. Bucket him. But <laughs> well, to nothing better than a little fish slime in the shack, huh? Oh, yeah. Good save, Shep. But, Connor, your White Castles are done. Well, I'm oh, going to eat mine? one. I'm going to eat one, you eat the other one. Of course. Just a little snack. It's like tradition. As soon as we set up, we got They're a little hot, though. I don't know. Oh, you just got to get in there. Okay. Get in there. They are very hot. <laughs> Celebratory White Castle for the win. It's starting to go. That's terrible. P, how's the grill coming out there, buddy? It's really cold, but it's starting to go. All right, well, Peyton's fishing. I'm going to set my rattle reel up here. Peyton's probably going to grab it before I even get to it, but whatever. Does this hole even go all the way through? I don't know. Well, apparently someone didn't drill that hole deep enough because it doesn't go through. Some burgies? I think there's six in there right now. And it is windy and cold, so this grill's only sitting at like 300. Good. So they're gonna cook slow, but that's okay. We're smoking them too, huh, Bubba? Literally almost smoking them. That's where he's gonna sit. Yep, yep. Oh, there's eight in here. Oh, perfect. Oh, they'll cook just fine, I think. You hear that little sizzle? Yeah. It's a good sign. If it wasn't sizzling, I'd be a little worried, huh? Woo wee, P. Those are looking pretty good. Thanks All right, for cooking. cooked cold, so we'll see how good they are. Is that a no ketchup burger? Oh, they're cooked. No ketchup burger. How is it? It's good. good. How are them fries? Microwaved? What was that ketchup? Was oh soggy? my goodness. Are they cold? <laughs> no, just soggy from microwave. We're not bad. Gross. We're not bad. You can microwave Let me these. Have one of these. I didn't oh my them. gosh. Take a little bite. They're not bad. Feel that. It's like They're a churro. I wish you guys could feel how nasty those feel. They're like not that bad. It's like a churro. What's that feel like? It's like a worm. I think everybody should try this. Does it feel pretty big? It looks pretty big. Yeah, it's big. Is that a boy? Just came in and crushed it, eh? <laughs> yeah. Hammered it. Bauer, you're grabbing this. It's not it's fighting like a northern, though. No, I it's not. It I wonder what it's it is. Walleye. Is it? I don't know. No, it's no, a Oh! Look at that greasy old thing. Oh my god. This thing's big. He bit it too. Oh my! That a boy. Yeah, that's a big one. These are my predators now here. <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful. Oh. Let's go. Oh, he was mad. Good catch, Peyton. That a boy, Peyton. Woo! -hoo. Sounds done here in this shack. All right, we got some goose brats. I'm not sure what flavor these are. These might be the wild rice and cheddar. I'm not really sure. We're just gonna have to find out. <laughs> Look at the steam rolling off that. How hot is that? This is a wild rice one. Yeah? What do you think of it? Really good. Yeah. yeah. Scale of one to ten. This is a what? wild game brat. I mean, probably like a seven and a half. Okay. So, I mean, Pretty good. Alright, alright. Get him, ship. Rattle reel went off. Get him, ship. He might be on it, I don't know. See if he's there, Bubba. Nope. Nothing. Oh, yeah, he's a bit still there. Yeah, he's good. Well, rattle reel went off. Uh, first one we've had in a while, but hey, it is what it is. We got a little movie going. We're just vibing. Hopefully, another fish comes in, and hopefully, it's actually decent size and it eats it. Good morning, Connor. Good morning. What time is it? 7.05. So it's 45 minutes before sunrise. Right on. Oh, hey, thanks for bringing those in for me. Yeah, they're going to be pretty cold, hey? Morning, Shep. But it is bright and early here in the morning. Uh, like I said, it's a little bit before sunrise. 
and we are going to be going perch fishing. There's a little perch slough not too far away from us that uh, we're going to be targeting. Hopefully some jumbo perch. We don't know how it's going to go. Um, clearly last night didn't go that well because you guys didn't really see us too much. Um, not many fish were caught, just that one walleye, nothing else really bit. So hopefully this morning we can get some fresh perch for the uh, fish fry tomorrow for the Super Bowl. Fingers crossed we can find them. Anyways, we're going to go over to the spot and I will see you guys there. Well, fishing was no bueno this morning. We caught nothing really uh, worth showing you guys. While we were gone, this guy was holding down the fort, and he was kind of clapping, weren't you, buddy? Yeah, I caught a few walleyes. Connor caught a couple nice walleyes, and uh, right now we're trying to get the oven started to make some lovely pizza for the boys. Kyle and Peyton had to go back to town, which is unfortunate, so it's just going to be us three, Shep, me, and Connor. Um, after we eat lunch, we're going to go hop around and uh, maybe try catching some smallmouth. If not, we'll head back to the little perch slough and try and figure it out we got a little cold and hungry but after we're done making this pizza uh just kind of see how things go figure out what we want to do and we'll bring you guys along what do you want to do go get a little weird with some small mouth well it's currently two o'clock in the evening we're gonna go try and catch some small mouth and if the small mouth don't work out we're gonna go back to the perch slough i think regardless we're gonna go back to the perch slough anyways you just hold on tight and hopefully we can catch some fish oh we're gonna start fishing. Connor's drilling me a lovely hole. Thank you, Connor. I think the smallies are here. Can you flush that out once? Thanks. We'll see if they'll fit up this hole, huh? Show you guys what I'm gonna be using. It's gonna be using a frostbite tantrum. Nice and green. You're on? Let's go. Shep's got a smallie. I wonder if it's even gonna fit up the hole. Six inch hole. Let's go! It's just a little guy. Mm, that's my first smallie through the ice, folks. That a boy. Pump. He's aggressive. He's a little guy. They're usually a little bigger. Crush that. Nice. That a boy. Uh, Small so little dweeb. Good times. See you later. Oh, right on, Shep. Right on. It, there it goes. Damn, they must not be on top of the rock pile today. Sad. Go he. Yeah. There's a fish down there. Can't see my lure though. Oh, that was a big fish. Got two looking at me. Here we go, on, smallie on. I don't know how big it is. Probably not all that big. Oh, well, it's not a bad one. We'll take it. Hey. hey. Nice little smallie. He's a cutie. Well, the boys are happy. They got their smallmouth. I also got my smallmouth. I'm happy. Time to go catch some perch. We're gonna go move lakes. We'll see you guys there. Alrighty, we're starting to fish. As you guys can see, buttloads of fish. Fishing four feet of water. And we already got two nice little jumbo perch on the ice. But there's millions and millions of these little guys. Up in the shallow water here, just fishing a frostbite tungsten with some spikes, and my hook is a little bent out. I gotta push that back into place. But 
we're gonna drop back down and see if we can't get some more. We've been marking all these little fish and big ones will come in out of nowhere and spook all the other little fish and that's when you catch your big ones. But, you know, you gotta mark the big ones first. It's been a while. We've been fishing for a long time now and it's been a lot of sorting, but Oh, Peyton's on. Nice one? Yeah. That a boy. What'd you get, Peyton? Ooh. Second chance. Nice. What is she? 12 and 3 quarter. 12 and 3 quarter. Nice. Oh my god. Yep. That's nice. No, oh, he came off in the hole. Oh, that was really big. What? I missed one really big. Sure. No. Catch him. I'm trying to. He liked down his down low. Uh, just got four big ones. Yeah. I've seen a ton of little ones. Yeah. yeah. Just kind of figuring them out though. Yeah. It's 13 and a quarter. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, it's going to take a little bit of ice. Yeah. We've got 14 snow days on this morning. We've got 30 snow days. Yeah. Welcome to the word get out. Yeah. 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 Real quick. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty. Get back at her. Yeah. Uh, have a good day. Big one. Oh my god. Nice, beautiful dusky perch. Well, as most of you guys know, uh, I haven't kept fishing like over a month or so. I haven't kept fishing since early ice and with the big fish fry we're gonna have you know i decided we should be able to keep a couple and it's not like we're probably gonna catch our limit here it's more of like getting five to ten fish probably and then you know call that good get some nice fillets off these guys here's a nice one Nice little tenor. Oh my god. Yeah, these are the little guys that are down there. They're not very big. What the size of my pinky. But he will grow into a big one sometime soon. They all spook. It's so crazy. Perch are scared of perch, but they're beautiful. Oh my god, there's a big in. Tanker. Tanker. Oh yeah. Like really big. He swiped at it but missed it. Oh no, I think he's going to leave. It might be a pike, dude. It's so big. Oh, there you go. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty big. I don't know. I'm going to get him on the bump, though. This fat. Not very long, I don't think. Um, 13. I don't know why I freaked out. It looks massive on live scope. Oh, there's a nice fish. 
right out of its mouth. Shoot. Botch that one, boys. Just saying how I wanted to go inside to the Permian warm up. And of course, big fish shows up out of nowhere. Oh, it's definitely a fish. There we go. I knew it was a perch, dude. It was just... He liked it on the bottom, hey? Eh? Oh, ripped to his eye. Well, we just got back from the perch slough. It was pretty cold out there and windy, but we ended up catching like 10 keeper nice perch for the Super Bowl fish fry. We didn't really hammer them, but the fish that we did catch were nice, minus the uh, small little guys that we caught. And uh, we just got the rattle reels down. Hopefully some walleyes come in and we can get a couple. So with that being said, we're just gonna chill, relax. We're getting the shack heated up right now and uh, we'll get nice and toasty and hopefully the rattle reels go crazy. Get that mo. Get him. Rattle reel went off. Come on, Shep. Looks like I'm the good luck. Yeah, Peyton just got off work. How's it going? It's going good. Good. I'm ready to catch some, hopefully. Yeah, hopefully. Nothing's on there, folks. False alarm. Bummer. Whew, it is cold out there, but good morning everyone. It is now the next day. I never filmed us going to bed. Um, I just kind of figured it was kind of boring and you guys didn't really care for me to say good night. So, with that being said, I do have to run in town early this morning, which is all right. The boys are still sleeping. I didn't want to film the outro and wake them up. Thank you for watching today's video. We greatly appreciate you guys staying till the end. Thank you for watching and we'll catch you guys on the next one.